what are the components of a complete electronically controlled spraying system and how much do they cost? Now our FlexFlow system consists of three key parts. Firstly, we have the FlexFlow system itself. Now this is the electronic control unit that controls the spray nozzles. This is the kind of the brain of the system, if you like. Secondly, we have the nozzle bodies. Now these are the electronically controlled nozzles. They have a rapid response solenoid valve in them that controls the on-off cycle, receives a signal from the FlexFlow system itself. And then finally, we have the spray nozzle tips that go into these nozzle bodies. And there's many, many different types of these. So what does it all cost? Firstly, let's look at the control system. So the FlexFlow control system comes in two core models. The FlexFlow 1000 system, this can control two spray zones. Now a spray zone is an independently controlled nozzle or set of nozzles. And in each of those spray zones in the FlexFlow 1000, you can have up to six spray nozzles controlled. There are up to 12 nozzles in total over two independently controlled spray zones. Next, we have the FlexFlow 2000 system, and this can control up to 20 different spray zones. So a much more advanced model, allowing for more complex spraying systems and more degrees of control. So you can have up to 20 different sensor input triggers into each of those spray zones. You can control up to 20 independent nozzles, if you like, over 20 spray zones with the FlexFlow 2000 system. Now this comes in three sub-models. You've got a 10 nozzle system, 16 nozzle system, and a 20 nozzle system. So what do all these cost? So the FlexFlow 1000, first of all, this is two spray zones and up to 12 nozzles in total, costs 8,500 pounds. The FlexFlow 2000 with its up to 20 spray zones that comes in a 10 nozzle system. This costs 19,000 pounds. A 16 nozzle system costs 22,500 pounds. And the full 20 nozzle system costs 24,000 pounds. So let's look at the nozzle bodies, which is the next core component. The nozzle body is the body of the nozzle with the integrated solenoid valve in there that's controlled by the FlexFlow system. These come in two models, the basic model, the industrial model. This is made of non-hygienic material, so it's not suitable for rural applications, but perfectly good for any non-hygienic applications. And it has a slightly slower response solenoid valve in there in the advanced model. So this is the EHPI nozzle body, and this costs 815 pounds per nozzle body at the time of recording and then we have the EHP model which is an all stainless steel design so it's suitable for hygienic and farmer applications and it has a more rapidly responding solenoid in there which can be used with some applications for that really really fine control and the EHP nozzle body is £1800 per nozzle body at the time of recording. So finally what about the nozzle tips? This is what dictates the actual spray pattern that comes out of the nozzle and flow rate. And there's a huge variation in these. We can have either flat fan, hollow cone or full cone spray patterns, depending on the tip you have. This can be in a variety of different flow rates, depending on the tip you have. And then you can have a number of different spray angles in there as well. The selection of the nozzle tip gives you a wide, wide range of different spray types that you can get out of the FlexFlow EHP system. It can also be made in a number of different materials. So we can make them in hygienic materials, we can make them in hard wearing materials. This gives a big, big variation in cost here. But typically, a nozzle tip will vary in cost between sort of 15 and about 100 pounds. Now, as you can see, this isn't a hugely significant part of the overall cost of the system. So let's look at a quick example to put it all together. Let's imagine we need a spraying system that has two different spray zones, so two different independently controlled set of nozzles, and there's four nozzles in each of those spray zones. So a FlexFlow 1000 system would be perfectly adequate to cope with that. So for each of those eight nozzles in total, imagine it's a non-hygienic application, so we'd need eight lots of the EHPI industrial nozzle bodies. So that's eight lots of 850 pounds plus 8,500 pounds for the FlexFlow 1000 system. And then finally, we need eight nozzle tips in there. So the fairly basic ones are 20 pounds for the tips. So all in all, we've got 8,500 pounds for the FlexFlow 1000 control system, eight lots of 850 pounds for the EHPI model bodies and eight lots of 20 pounds for the nozzle tips. Grand total of 15,460 pounds for the complete system. Now, bear in mind, this doesn't include any plumbing or any pumps or anything like that, or any sensors that you might be hooking up to the FlexFlow 1000 system to trigger the spray nozzles to come on and off. So all that needs to be added in. We can provide quotations for all of that, or you can provide it to yourself or by a third party. Music